boys and girls, it's time for the amazing knot in the handkerchief trick. Here is the handkerchief and now for the knot. We'll open up the handkerchief and we'll tie a knot in the middle. Then we... On. <laughs> I've come all the way here today to the school and I've brought the wrong handkerchief. It's too small. I'll fix it. Is that any better? Yeah. Any better now? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> it's too big now. This is what's known. <laughs> now this is what's known. Uh, hey! Could I have my handkerchief back? Thank you. Somebody might blow their nose in my hanky. <laughs> we'll take the handkerchief and tie a knot in the middle. Look, this is how you used to tie your laces before Velcro. Look, around there, isn't that right? Mm -hmm. Under there. Pull, uh, oh. <laughs> Let me see if I can surprise it. A magical, mysterious cannot watch. <whistles> Hello, what's your name? Grim. Grim, could you stand for just a moment, please? Just where you are. And would you blow on that knot, please? No, big blow. Very good, thank you. You can sit down now. Guess who had onions for breakfast? Ha uh ha. -huh. Let me see if we can get the handkerchief to stand all on its own up in the air. See, all on its own up in the air. No blowing at the back, thank you. All on its own up in the air. See? I said no blowing. Hey, hands up any boys and girls who are from Japan. Okay, hands down. Now, I don't know if you know, but over in Japan, they have a thing whereby you take a piece of paper. By folding it up, you can make different shapes or animals. It's very clever, and they call it origami. Down in Tralee in Ireland, they do the same thing with handkerchiefs, and they call it kerigami. Yes. Now, what you have to do is take the handkerchief, you turn it inside out once, twice, and thrice. Thrice, that's French for three times. You make a little hat, un petit chapeau. You see, I am educated. Honours in kindergarten, that's me. And a black belt in origami. Bonjour, Mrs. Now you turn it inside out, once again this way, once again this way. And if you're lucky, you have a little iron with which to press your clothes. A little iron. <laughs> it's hot. Punk earrings. A big moustache. Hello. Hello. A Christmas cracker. Now, to find out what's in the cracker, you don't have to pull it. But if you take this bit here, if you twiggle it around and twiggle iggle those two bits together, if you're lucky, you end up with two little ears on a little head, a body and a tail, and it looks like, it looks like a little mouse. <laughs> a laboratory mouse. <laughs> it's all right. Oh, no, it's not a real mouse. It's a toy mouse. But to get him to go, you have to take the magic key, the magic key, and wind him up. Wow. 
Now you have to be careful not to wind him up too much. At the last show, he got away and he ran up a teacher's leg. <laughs> <laughs> you should have seen her jump. Oh, she was sitting just there. <laughs> Now, the funny thing about the little mouse, this is the bit I forgot to tell you. Now, I'll tell you, no, it's a bit strange, but I'm going to tell you now. What? Do you know, I knew what you know, I shouldn't have, oh, I shouldn't have wound him up so much. Stop it now, look, stop, sit still. Hey, hey, guys, get the back. Stop. Look, it's all. Hey, go back, go back, stop it. Now look, hey, hey. <laughs> stop. Hey, go back, stop it. Hey, stop. Would you, would you help me? Would you give him a little tickle on his tail? Would you mind just give him a little tickle? Now be. Mind the mouse! Oh, quick! Can I have the mouse back? Quick! I'm so sorry. Quick! Thank you very much, my good. Whoa! Thank you. Could I have him back? Thank you very much. Oh my goodness, you really are. Oh no, he's got it back. Where'd you go? Thank you. Oh, it's all right. It's all right. I'll pull it. Oh. It's a... oh. I shook too much. You know what that means? That means it's curtains for the mouse.